Welcome back to RimWorld. JC here. And this time, we're still pursuing the precision turrets. Yep, we still want those sniper turrets. Then we're going to do a whole load of short little projects. Mostly to do with medicine. That should be handy. You know, stuff like no longer getting diseases and all of that because they haven't you know shot me in the ass a couple of times so let's get on with it go on you lot chop chop we're doing all the things How are we doing for these? Uh, we've got a lot of gold. We're alright for plasteel. We're alright for steel. The components are being produced. There you go. Excellent. It is still a long night. We have no clue when that will finish. None at all. Which is a thing. Psychic drone, isn't it? And we have a wild boar that is self tamed. Mm -hmm. uh, okay. Um, please come here. Come to us. Congratulations, ladies and gentlemen. Bacon is back on the menu. Just to be a bit weird like that. There you go. Cleaning bots just like whoosh, whoosh, and then slowly wanders back, and then clean something, and slowly wanders back. Which is fine. Oh, yeah, I don't need this hibernation pad much anymore. Let's deconstruct it being a pain. It's consuming 70 watts that doesn't need to be consumed. Huh? You finished making raw composite. It's still got to go through here in a ridiculous amount of energy. It does require a fair amount of energy. The reactor's doing all right though. Mostly. <gasps> we have finished precision turrets. Dum dum dum. We now have sniper turrets. Right. Uh, and a defoliator ship. Which is fun. Scyther, Lancer, Lancer, Pikeman. Great. Lovely. Charming. Well, I know which side the sniper turret is going on. Security. Precision turret. Made of composite. Just there, please. A single but precise shot at a fa fairly long distance. There you go. Right, now start building that. Chem fuel now, haven't I? I should really start making some mortars, which is on the machining table. I think, yeah, high explosive. Five should do the trick. Just, just 
just make five. I think we need a bullpup TRM anymore. There we go. They'll eventually get around to that. I mean, the defoliator ship. Yes. Its radius will slowly grow over time until it reaches our crops and then we die horribly. Of course, by which point I would have mortared this to death. Or at least, you know, sunk a mortar somewhere in here and murdered as many of these gits as I possibly could before they get over here. Oh! Yeah. No, I can't actually tell it to fire at something. But what does the upgrade do? Okay, description. Um, massively increases the precision turret's overall accuracy. Somewhat increases barrel durability, but decreases the rate of fire. Also makes it directly controllable by me. Wow. Yep. Power consumption goes up by a lot. Halves the rate of fire. Cam become, becomes manually aimable, so I can go, you shoot this thing. I mean, yeah, the steel military turret has far more health than this thing. Oh, fire suppression's online. There you go. Um, yeah, we kind of need to put the fire suppression in here, don't we? Which is under the hygiene mod. It's because that's the one I did. Fire sprinkler. There we go. Okay, looks like I'm going to need two. We'll put one there, that'll automatically connect up. Oh wait, hold on. Put one there, cancel that. Plumbing. Do that. Because then that will cover all of that. Now all I have to do is make sure I cover All of this, I th think if I do that, that's annoying. That's probably the safest bet. Now, how to get the key, how to get Plumbing out there. That should work. That means this area is fire protected. Uh, when in reality it's just going to explode anyway, but you know. It, it makes me feel better that there is, you know, at least some fire prevention. Also, I will need to put fire prevention down here. Because mechanoids have been nice, but one of their larger units certainly does have um, an incendiary launcher. You don't mess with an incendiary launcher because it sets people on fire and then they run around panicking until they get set out by the fire extinguishers, <clears throat> which is handy. Right, what are we going to do? We just need to get it going. We need... Okay. They're, they're building that and then they're going to go to sleep or whatever or something. I mean, you totally don't need to go and build these components. These are... These mortar shells I need to kick everything off. Yeah, I totally don't need that.
Well, at least the sprinkler system's online. Fishing. Fishing? Oh. It's already made them. That, that, that was observant of me. Right! How's everybody's rest? Okay, what I'm going to do is I'm going to tell you to go... Go eat. And... You should also... Now go and consume a fine meal. There's a reason I'm doing this. It's like, right, you lot. Down here. Wait, I don't know. My bad. I need you standing here first. Because you're the best one here for doing this. You done? Are you done? Good. Right. Get down here. I'd like you to um, hold fire. Of course, it won't work until somebody's manning it. Please man this. Okay, it is now loaded with a high explosive shell. It'll land somewhere within this radius. Uh. Well, uh, JC has reached intellect level 20 by firing a mortar. Shells incoming. Ready, set, and... Splat! Okay, they woke up, but they haven't actually, you know... So what I really need to do is set this to there and just open up on it. This could take a while. Oh, we finished drug production. Once it gets to a certain point, they'll they'll attack us. Hopefully. Well, blast it. Might as well de do that and undo that. I'll set that to hold fire. Right, well, we won't be attacking anytime soon. They're all active. Few, one, two more mortars, and that would have been done. But we kind of need to build them. So everybody can get their sleep and all that. It's, it's a pain in the arse. Mechanoids are a pain in the what's it. They always will be. Have ten. 
You know what? Screw it. Ten. Have ten rounds. Stop fishing. Kind of annoying when you're waiting him for him to actually do stuff and he's just like now nah, i'm gonna go and do recreational stuff build the splosives thank you because <laughs> totally if we have a trade caravan come in via this section this bit here they're gonna die horribly The only thing I can say is at least doesn't require like components. This requires chem fuel, which we've got an absolute ton of. Why is it? Pump limit of 50. Why is it still pulling more out? I do not know. Like, hello. Bellist range. You done? Are you done with that? No, he's not done with that. He's not close. Oh, oh, he, oh, he's sleep time again. There you go. He spent all day making shells. Meanwhile, we're restocking on steel. I don't think I really need that much steel. Two stacks is probably a bit excessive. There we go. Won't activate for the game for a while now, which is good. There you go, you need to consume stuff, you need to... Okay. You can have a shower. I need you to eat some food. All right, you stand there. Why is your mood so low? Well, that's your own fault. I'm going to blip this once. You're going to clean the sand. Nah, friend. Stand there. Brewing tea? No, I don't think so. We're standing here. We're going to go Blops Mechanoids again. Wait for it to be ready to fire. Make sure its target is still set. You may fire. Round two. Here they come. Right, set that to hold fire. You can book it. It's all the way out there. It's taking no, no. Oh, yes, good. Missed. 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 And again. Oh, can't shoot against that. Where's you shooting at? Oh, you could have. That can outrange them. I can't tell it to do that. Well, this is going according to plan. I love that the bot's re rebarreling it.
This is going to take a while. Okay, right, we can send... Um... Yeah, he's never going to be able to reach that from here. Okay, right. Head off back. Do whatever you need to do. The turret will have to deal with this thing. Eventually. This fight could last forever. Oh! Or it could one-shot it. loses power? Front left, front right, rear right, and it loses power. Alright, um... That went surprisingly easily. I'm shocked, actually. But either way, excellent. Good job, everybody. It was well done. Just need to fix everything up. Definitely needs an accuracy upgrade. more. There you go, that's close enough. A Mega Wolverine. Friend, you don't want that. This sniper turret is going to have your ass. Same with the military grade turrets. They're going to have you as well. That's it. Go hunt a rat, because that is a far better option. Haha, I'm going to hunt one of your colonists, the front gate just says. <laughs> no. Now, of course, we're getting into the situation where where am I going to stick another one of these benches? Well, across here. It's not like there's anything that needs to be done in there. There is one more production thing I need to do. Where's the normal... medicine bench? It's, it's a jade meteorite. Where? It's there. Isn't that nice? Okay, there's the electric medicine. I don't need that one. I require the standard one. There we are. The medicine lab. There. Boom. We're able to make things. Right. The first thing I want to do is make sure I've got a supply of medicine. Do until we have. 20. This is just the initial one. After this, I'll set it down to singles just to make sure we can top ourselves back up. For the moment, we have one. Yeah, 
nutrient from neutro flower petals. <laughs> yeah. Don't really do anything else. That's easy, flu. I'm researching a load of others, so. A bandage kit. Less potent than medicine kit, and you can just use. No! I just. I just use medicine, thanks. Uncured composite, yep. Still got a lot of composite to make. And we're out. At least the tank's near nigh on full. It's good, I'm just draining it faster than I can make it. That's a problem with doing a large amount of composite. There are downsides to these things, obviously. Making a product that is entirely dependent upon large amounts of oil and not having large amounts of oil. Yeah. How does that sound familiar? Hmm, funny that. Nothing gets into this because it's automatically going into these. To restock our supply. So that's going to be happening for a while. The reactor's fine. We're almost 50% of the control rods, which is not brilliant. Oh, right, yeah, there we go. That's the end of the line. I've got some military clothing so I can give JC his berry back because reasons. What are we going to add to the end of that? Well, what are we going to add to the end of that? There's nothing from this list, apparently. Not sure why I'm looking here. This is like the really advanced stuff. Glass turrets, Vulcan cannon, Devastator Mortar. No. You start getting into here and you just start getting even more. It's just so wrong. I can turn oil into Neutramine if I wanted to. Um. Oh, really? I was actually looking at the other form of Neutramine that you can get. I have two mods that allow you to do it. It's derivative from this one. Advanced refining. Edibles that allow you to make synthetic meat. No. Because in essence, you could then use crops to make meat. It's a convoluted way of doing it, but you can do it. Okay, let's go. Neutramine synthesis. What's that kitty? Synthesize neutramine from nutrient solution and protein mash by cleverly converting stem cells with bioengineered 
organisms. Aye. <coughs> Neutramine can now be made at the drugs lab. And we're going to need all the prerequisites for that as well. Alright. What we also need is we also need to do some research projects. I mean, yeah, we've got this one going, which has increased our sniper protection, but we don't have much close range protection anymore. I mean, these, these snipers, they're sh snipers, shotgun turrets. They're doing a good enough job, but I kind of want to play with electricity. Because what's more than blasting your enemy into oblivion, then electrocuting the git while you're doing it. Oh, and it's really effective against mechanoids. Because whereas they adapt to EMP, just passing large amounts of electricity through them, they don't tend to be able to adapt to that. You know, funny that. You know, a little pulse. You can sort of jig things around, but just passing. Here, here's a bolt of electricity. Kazap. Are you going to adapt to that? As it sits there jittering. Uh, oh, I'm just going to take a pot shot at you. Pop. Don't worry. Perfectly normal. Okay, well, um, come on, people. I want to see some progress. Oh, medicine is being produced. Or well, at least it was. Do I not have any more Neutramine? Oh, I've got some Neutramine, but we have reached 21. Here we go. So I can now change this bill instead of making a batch of four. I just want to make a batch of one. Set to the same. Little well medicine. Okay. Um. Do until we have twenty. There we go. Keep twenty. We can now make glitter weld medicine. Um, close the list. Reopen the list. <laughs> there it is. You need three Neutramine, two Medicine, Ambrosia. Yeah. Need to be able to make Ambrosia. Well... Oh, mad scientist trader. They may have Neutramine. I do actually have Neutro flower, so I could be start growing Neutro flower in this stuff and just use that to sort of make Neutramine. Neutro flower requires a seven in growing to sow. None of your people have that. Bots do. Okay, you two, this, so it, oh, it does it for each one anyway. Okay. When you wake up, please report that and call the mad scientist. So we'll grow some Nutrif flower. There we go. Neutramine. Yeah, we can buy Neutramine. Do I have anything that I can sell? Uh, a large amount of gold? Some wood. I have a large amount of wood I can sell. That'll do. I don't think I need 123. 
50 would work. There we go. Sell a thousand wood. I've got enough. It'll make me some more money. I can afford the Tesla coil now. Even more so with this. Excellent. Drop that. Oh, no, it's this button. Pull up this thing. Fuel reprocessing. <laughs> uh, Tesla coil, please. Ah, oh, there we go. We bought the Tesla coil recipe. We can now electroshock therapy our enemies. Eventually. Ah, yes, of course, we're being held back by the lack of um, fuel being produced, which can be remedied by just throwing more power at it. Oh, panoxicillin production. Or oh, that's how I pronounce it. It's probably got a different name, but you know. We've got some, we've got enough nutrient. We can start producing medicine for everyone. Once I've researched them all. Takes ten days. Twice as long. Mm. So in reality, it's going to take twenty days because half the day it can't grow because it's resting. But its fertility is two hundred and eighty percent. So gonna take about 10 days <laughs> okay what's actually what's the harvest off of these things harvest of five if I go over to here bills Just, just do forever. Basically, just, if you can make Nutramine, make it. It's the last thing in the list, basically. But if you can make Nutramine with the flower petals, go ahead, do it. So we get one Nutramine <laughs> for every two flowers. Eight Nutramine per harvest. Mm-hmm. Definitely gonna get keep us going with that. Grumble, rumble, 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 grumble, rumble. What's your foul mood? Why are you in a Get over yourself? Look, you got nuzzled by a cat. The only cat in the place. And you just did it again. Oh, you're not part of any faction. Oh. Sorry, man. It was bad, man, but if you were actually part of a faction, I'd actually rescue you. But I don't need more people. I'd only banish you anyway. <clears throat> it's better this way. I wouldn't be supplying you with any clothing either. Which is basically a death sentence, considering it's minus 34 outside. The dude with no clothes on. Ah. Ass. There you go. 
screwed me over. Well, I've lost two batches, basically. That would be a, a safe bet. Forty-five. That would be enough. But yeah, solar flare once again. We may very well lose all of these as well. That's not a major issue. Annoyance is it takes so long to produce this stuff that getting whacked like that it's a bit of a pain <clears throat> at least we're not draining the batteries because nothing can consume power let's at least cremate the person one, the power's back on. In your own time. You know. You totally don't have things to go and do. Oh, oh. Tea plant has died. Oh, everything's dying. Everything in here is dying because it's too cold. Because this solar flare is lasting so long. So not only has it killed all of the crops... It's coiled the Nutri flower. All of the, there you go. And now it kicks in. It took so long that the insulation wasn't able to keep this at a temperature high enough to keep the plants alive. So we lost everything. This is why I hate solar flares. It's just dumb. There you go. Auto throttling. Very annoying. And of the worst of them all would have been the Devil Strand, because that takes forever. What is going on? Why did you attack a black bear? I'll have the free food, but uh, mate, you're, you're gonna wanna, I don't know. Is it a doctor? Dangerous temperature. You're, you're tending to yourselves. That's good. You should be tending to yourselves. But because of that temperature, you should be, I don't know, leaving? I'm just going to leave this food out here. Because, um, well, the rest of your party has left. So unless you're heading right for my medical facility, you're not going to make it. Stop bleeding on my floor. Stop bleeding on my floor. Oh, you're stable. What about your friend? Ah. He's not doing so well. There you go, you got tended to. You're not gonna bleed out. Okay, that's a big old list of things that just happened. Mecha gone. Yep. That's good. Uh, that person's got an infection. Not great. 
and there's a Manhunter pack. So the first thing we're going to do is activate the droid, because the droid can now deal with him. Everybody is now running down here. They're coming from this side, so JC, you go there. There. Max. There. Okay, is a Manhunter pack of what, precisely? It, it, it's, it's a Manhunting pack of wolf beavers. Wolf beavers. And on that note, or bombshell, or insanity, we're going to end it here. We'll see how we fare with these wolf beavers next time. But, thank you for watching. And until next time, this is JC, out.